Hello, this is Let's Drive Ohio number um, one, I think. Yeah. This is US Route 23 uh, between Waverly and Chillicothe. We are going northbound. Just starting up the big hill. I decided to shoot this video today because the weather's sort of decent. The uh, foliage is lovely. And it's a pretty big hill. Don't really have a whole lot more to say about it. So I'll probably just ramble for the rest of this video. Also, um, yeah, don't tell my bosses I'm doing this because I'm actually driving for work right now. So, anyway, I believe this uh, five-lane road was built in the 60s or 70s or something like that. It was, it's uh, part of uh, one of the Appalachian Development Corridors, Corridor B, I think, uh, maybe C. For some reason, it changes at Portsmouth. Uh, it's either B or C, depending on... I don't know why it's not just one big corridor. But uh, anyway, Appalachian Development Corridors have standards almost like an expressway, though as you can see they're not always divided and they do have local driveway access, but they are generally designed to accommodate high-speed traffic at least in rural areas. Reaching uh, the summit here, there's a uh, uh, little state highway, I guess it goes to a state park or something, and it says Scioto Trail goes uh, that way. Scioto Trail is actually the name of the old road, uh, which I think they built this on almost the exact same alignment. Here we're cresting the big hill, starting back down again. Pretty much backing off the throttle entirely until we get to this next curve. I think it's interesting how the steepest part of this whole hill is on either side of the summit, right at the top. And it gets a little more mild. Lots of little houses and businesses along here some trailer homes, but you know, not knocking it, it's probably one of the most affordable ways to live if you're going to live out here. I can respect that. If I wasn't so much a city guy, I'd probably end up in a place like that myself, because I'm cheap. Cemetery entrance, oh boy. Laurel Hills Memory Gardens. There it is up on the right. Ah. Have to keep alternating which arm holds up the phone here to shoot this video. And now it's a divided road. Um, I'm not sure exactly when we went from Pike County to Ross County. I don't think it was that back there. I think it was near the start of the video. I 
when I upload this, YouTube is probably going to say, your video appears to be shaky. Shall we even it out for you? And I've tried that effect, just previewing it on another video. And it looks really weird. It's kind of like you're floating. But, like, you look at the edges of the screen, and it gets all distorted. We're uh, pretty much at the bottom of the hill now, I think. Uh, not too much longer before this becomes the uh, freeway through Chillicothe. Uh, let's see. That billboard will tell us. No, no, it doesn't have a distance on it. Okay. Well, that uh, adult bookstore is where the freeway begins. Definitely starting to see signs for Chillicothe businesses. And, yeah, it's uh, the freeway is starting just up ahead. I'm going to put the phone away now. Bye-bye.